Hey guys, and welcome to Let's Click Photography. My name is Dave, and this week we are up in the Lake District at Rydal Water. I'm so excited to be back out doing landscape photography, vlogging again. We're at a beautiful location. We've got beautiful conditions. Uh, maybe not right now. I mean, it's a lovely day. Lovely day to be a tourist. Not so much to be a photographer, but um, we've had beautiful conditions. And I thought I'd start off with this because I'm gonna take a shot of this boathouse now. I'm gonna do that because I think it's gonna be quite interesting to see the contrast between the boathouse photo that I take now at, let's see what's, ooh, just shy of midday. And the boathouse shot I took this morning at around 6.30 a.m. And compare and contrast those two shots because as you guys well know, there are great times to come out and shoot and there are less than great times to come out and shoot. Note, I didn't say bad times to come out and shoot because you can always make something of anything. But there's no doubt that the weather plays a massive part in the photos that we take. And I had some fabulous weather this morning and this morning I am just overwhelmed. I am at Rydal Water in the southern lakes of the Lake District and wow it's simply stunning. We've got some beautiful mood and some beautiful atmosphere. I'm shooting today on the Canon R6. I've got the 24 to 70 loaded up. We're in at around 50 millimeter, although I'm going to try a couple of variations on that, a bit wider, a bit closer in, um, maybe a panoramic, but definitely something in the vertical composition of just an amazing scene. I've got a polarizer in the front to help me cut through the bank of fog that is lying across the water and giving that glorious atmosphere. The water's really still, so I just want 1.3 seconds just to smooth it out and give me a really beautiful reflection from the island that is just off from this boathouse that is our main subject. And I just think this really works. Let me know what you think of the shot down in the comments below and whether you think this works better as a closer up one or a bit of a wider, perhaps as the panoramic. But one thing's for certain, this is absolutely beautiful. So there's been loads going on here actually since we last spoke, which was now oh, almost 90 minutes ago. Uh, the fog's gone, the atmosphere's gone, the sun has burnt it all away, which I was completely expecting. I knew I wouldn't get long, which is why we haven't really spoke since I moved further along the shore. The fog was just starting to move and just starting to lift. So I got several shots just from around the shore here beautiful what a stunning place we've also had some RAF flybys some jets flying by there's another jet hence why this is on the front just in case I did manage uh, to aim it in the right direction I would say that aimed it in the right direction the last time they flew by it wasn't the best we also had some uh, wild swimmers yeah it actually looked quite cool in the fog so i catch one of those then there was a group of wild swimmers over on that bank just over there which meant that i needed to put a um, six stop filter on because they were just kind of sitting in the water only moving around in a small area 
So uh, I'm hoping that by putting that six stop filter on, I have ghosted them out of the image. I'd be really disappointed if I haven't. <laughs> This has been Let's Click Photography, and from me, for now. Ciao.